Hello there. Here is a video on how to change an NPC's role and it could still basically be the same NPC. Um, there's, there's two ways here you can do it and uh, as far as I know I don't think there's a way within the actual scripting there's no like set role command let's put it that way but this works and um, so whoops no I'm wrong screen here there we go so this guy is one way of doing it and he's a transporter and if I click on him he's got two places I can transport to now if I don't pick one of those it's not going to activate his role uh, script and then he won't do anything so what he does is if uh, if something activates his role script his role event I should say um, then he will despawn and he will spawn a test this guy called test trader in his in his uh, position so let's try that real quick I'll just do this and then I'm spawned over here by one and then when I go back he's called main trans um, he's turned into a trader all of a sudden so and the same way with that if I don't take one of these out of there it won't activate his role event so if you look at his script what he does he um, uh, also gets this uh, this uh, the other guy the test transporter in the clones he, he was someone I cloned earlier but you have to set his transporter ID to 12 and that's the uh, that's the ID of the um, the main trans uh, transporter route I, I got that with the MBT data I think I took the M, the MBT book which is very helpful this thing and uh, I think I did that and that told me that was a uh, transporter ID number 12 so if I click on this guy then and buy one of these blocks for a block um, he will turn back into the transporter guy with the correct um, information in him but so the the uh, trader data is saved within the NPC itself so you don't have to uh, it's somewhere in here I bet okay um, the other way of doing this would be this guy um, he has you click on him and he's a this is a trader okay I got there because I could put something else in there and now he's a banker this is one bank and then he's a now that was a bank before okay he was right yeah so he's a trader now yeah and this this trading data persists even though now he's back to this, the same the first bank yes I'm sorry that was a bank not a trade bank and how this works is I'm just using the pure um, MBT it's the same uh, NPC he's not being spawned or things like that he's not being the other guy was being deleted and then he this new one was being spawned in place of him this guy is just being changed his data within the NPC is being changed obviously a skin his name is being changed but here his role is being changed uh, from one uh, role three and also role three so there's two bankers but the banker ID is different it's two Anchor ID one and uh, oh set market one yeah okay I do have that set as a market yeah okay that makes sense that's why the market persists so um, that's two ways of uh, changing a role if you want one NPC to maybe carry out multiple parts after a dialogue or something like that he could change his identity thanks for watching uh, that's it I'll leave the scripts in the description. Bye.